few different types, well, several different types of hairstyles that you could use for your Lego person. So um, you need to think about what kind of hair you have and so what style would work best for what kind of hair you have. So you can think about um, when you're looking at a Lego Lego hair, it's not going to have like each little strand like it does when you're doing a regular self-portrait. It's going to be more cartoonish than that. Just a few lines to kind of represent it. So the first one we're going to start off with, um, we'll start off with a simple short haircut. So we're going to do kind of a curved line. It's going to start here. It's going to curve around just like that. So it doesn't quite get as far over as this, but it gets kind of close. And then it's going to come down like this. And then up just a little. It's almost touching, but not quite. And then it's going to go down and touch that line. And then there's going to be a curved line that comes up and touches there. Then on this side, we're going to have a curved line that comes up around the side like that. And then it's going to keep going all the way around and touch on top. And then this line is going to kind of go back into it. So that's kind of like um, like a short, maybe like a boy's haircut with the um, hair going off the side. So you could put kind of like a curved line off to the side like that. To make, to kind of show that the hair is going off the side. Um, the next one I'm going to show you is more of a girl's haircut. So it's going to be similar to this um, with, the, with the hair going kind of to the side like that. But it's going to be a little longer. So we're going to do a curved line up like this. And then we're going to actually take that around and bring it back down like that. And then the hair is going to come down. And then the same thing in this way, it's going to come down along the side. And then we're going to connect right here so that the hair finishes. And then we'll make a few lines to show that the hair is curving around like that. And then a few lines down here. So we don't have the shoulders in here, but you would draw these lines all the way down until they touch the shoulders. Okay. Next we're going to do, what if you don't have straight hair? So these are both straight hair. So we'll do um, one with a curlier hair. So um, instead of making that curve straight, you're going to make it a little wavy. Like that. And then you'll make another kind of wavy one coming down like that. And we'll make a line that comes up and goes around. And it's going to be a little wavy. All the way down. And then wavy down this side. And then we'll do like wavy lines inside to show that it's curly here. So you kind of get the idea with the Lego here. It's just simple lines instead of having um, you know a whole bunch of little strands of hair. It's more individual lines. So then um, you could do, um, well, a mohawk if you have a mohawk, but it's a self-portrait. So remember, if you, if you don't have a mohawk, you're not going to do a mohawk. But um, I'll show you an example in case you want to draw one later with a mohawk. And then you're going to draw, you can draw that hair sticking up um, like kind of all points. coming around like that. Um, you could do hair that, like this hair comes down until it touches your shoulders if you wanted it not to be quite so long. You could do hair that comes down and stops at a certain point. So it would come down and then it would go over like this. So that'd be kind of shorter hair. So there are lots of different options you could do. Um, you could do a baseball cap. 
So for a baseball cap, you would do a line in and a line in. And then you'll do a curved line. So this is like the bill of the cap. Curved line and a curved line. And then we come back. And it would curve again. And then you do the curve on top. And you'd have those lines that come down on a baseball cap and a little button on top. So that'd be kind of like a baseball cap. Um, so you can keep playing around with it, different things. Uh, maybe I'll make a ponytail on this one, like a side pony. So I'll do curved line, curved line, making those kind of bangs again. But then I'm going to do a side pony, so I want the hair to come like this out the side and then go back up like that so it's kind of lines and lines just like that do a side pony so you can keep playing around look at yourself look at, look at a picture in your, of yourself and see which one uh, which hairstyle you think would be best for you and it doesn't have to be one of these I mean you can make whatever style you think would be best for you you can design it yourself you don't have to do the same one I'm doing so um, there's lots of different different ways that you can make hair on a a Lego person just remember they're gonna be simple lines nothing too um, nothing too detailed to make your different different designs for yours so um, go ahead and practice some different hairstyles and see which one works best to look like you and your self-portrait.